Hello, remote learners. This is Dr. Shivers. Hope you had a great weekend. Today is Monday, October the 19th. It's a PE day. We want you to get some good vigorous exercise today. So enjoy being outside with that. Hey, paper chains today, they're due at 1230 PM. Your picture's on Padlet. If you could do us a huge favor, we have some plans that we're working on. Will you please save your paper chains for us? There's gonna be an announcement that I'll share soon where we're gonna to try to see what we can do with those things. So save those paper chains is all you need to know for now. Hopefully you're still building away by staying focused on your classwork, but also seeing who can get the longest chain with two different measurements, okay? Um, today and this week, we're gonna talk about STEM. STEM, as you know, stands for science, technology, engineering, and math. Sometimes we put an A in there for the arts or agriculture. Sometimes we put an R in there for reading. So you might see STEAM or STREAM or other variations of that. But I have loved STEM ever since I was a teacher. Here we are building some bridges at Bluemont. Here I am leading some teachers through some teams where we learned to build trebuchets. And then here's one of my cool robot friends. But I really enjoy being able to learn about these things. And it's because of the skills you get to practice. With science, you're working on observation and experimenting, making predictions and asking questions. With technology, you're being inventive, you're using tools, you're making things work, you're identifying issues and using computers and iPads and things like that. With engineering, you're solving problems, you're using materials, you're designing and creating different ways of building. And then with math, you're doing pattern, patterns and sequencing, exploring shapes, numbers, volumes and sizes. So they're just some of the skills that you're gonna be able to work with. We have some student projects that we're gonna to get to be able to look at. Here's one of our STEM teachers. To show Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Roberts. I hope you're having a great day and having a great time in STEM so far this semester, trimester. I just wanted to say that I'm really proud of all the work that you've done so far. And I know Dr. Shivers is gonna show some of it. So again, great job. And I can't wait to see what we do in the next trimester. So that was one of the several STEM teachers that work with us in remote learning. And here's one project we'll be sharing more soon. as it takes a while to load up. Let me pause here and we'll come back. Here we go. Run away, run away, yeah. Take your time, say a prayer, yeah. Recognize, <gasps> pray when you say yes. Yeah. Don't be cruel. So that was an example of a Rube Goldberg machine, a special machine that does several steps to make things work. So we just wanted to share that with you and hope you enjoyed that. We'll be showing lots of other projects this week as well. Have a great day learning, scholars. Stay brave, courageous, and creative.